This is Taylor from Nuts and Bolts Speed Training with a PowerPoint tip to help you make happy hour. Pulling off rapid fire alignments and distributions. And first I'm gonna show you how to quickly set this up and then walk through it slowly before showing you just how fast this can be. And if you wanna follow along, just drop three rectangles on a blank slide. And the first step to setting this up is to add the alignment tool to your QAT. So from the Home tab, click the Arrange Tool drop down and right click the Align Tool and in this right click menu select Add to Quick Access Toolbar. And with the Alignment Tool now in our QAT, the next step is to get it into the first position so that it's super easy to use. And to do that, we just need to click the downward facing arrow at the end of our QAT, select More Commands down below to launch a dialog box. And here in our dialog box window, I'm just going to click Remove to get rid of all these default commands until only the Align Objects or the Alignment Tool is there on my QAT. I'll then click OK to come back to our slide. So that's the setup. Now I'll slowly walk you through how it works. So holding shift, select the three objects, you add it to your slide, and we want to align them to the left. So hit and let go of the Alt key to open the ribbon guides, then hit and let go of the one key to open the alignment tool. And here in the drop down, we want to align to the left. So hit L for left, hit L, and all the objects snap into perfect left alignment, which is much faster than we could have done this manually, right? So that's an alignment. Now let's do a distribution. So with everything still selected, on your keyboard, hit and let go of the Alt key to open the ribbon guides, then hit and let go of the 1 key to open the alignment tool, and here in the drop down, this time we want to hit V for distribute vertically. Hit V, and the middle rectangle distributes evenly between the two other rectangles, which again, is much faster than we could have done so manually. And with that, now I'll show you just how fast this technique can be, and I'll hit page down for my next slide. And here on the next slide, I have a very rough, mocked up slide of some category highlights. And before I send this along to my colleague, I want to make sure that everything is in perfect relative alignment and positioning. So I'll quickly start here on the left, line to the left, line to the right, grab these boxes, T for top, H for distribute horizontally. Do the same thing down below, T for top, H for distribute horizontally, and walk it up, Shift F5 to spot check it. So far, so good. I can also put these into center and middle alignment. Put in these charts, center and middle alignment with the rectangles. Center and middle alignment, hit escape, shift F5 to spot check it. So far so good, hit escape. And I can also group all of the objects and Alt 1 H for distribute horizontally, Control Shift G, Shift F5, and there you go. So that's what the slide looks like using the objects as the anchors, grouping them and then distributing the entire graphic horizontally across the slide. Another option we have is to instead group each of the columns individually and then distribute them horizontally across the slide. Which if we do that, we'll ensure that we have equal distance on each side of the columns. And let me just quickly demonstrate. I'll hit Escape, Control Shift D for a new slide, group the first column, Control G, group the second column, Control G, and the third column, select the columns, change my alignment settings, Alt 1 A for align to slide, Alt 1 H for distribute horizontally, Control Shift G, and Shift F5. And there you have our layout with equal distance on each side of the columns. And if I go back to our other slide, there you don't. Now neither one of these layouts is right or wrong, it just depends on what you're trying to pull off. So that's how you can strategically use your QAT to pull off rapid fire alignments and distributions. Want to be three times faster at PowerPoint? Click the link below and check out our online workshop which is packed full of strategies and techniques. This is Taylor from Nuts and Bolts Speed Training and I'll see you at happy hour.